let me pull up my ice form here and let me go ahead and... Whoa! That was right in front of me. Slap her in there to go ahead and pick up the... Oh! Man. All of a sudden my aim is crap. really do not like having to revert. With these types of shenanigans that much. That almost looks like the uh, the bottom part of this almost looks like the thing that spits out the uh, dwarven spiders. The spiders and spider workers. Interesting banner. That is a chest. See what I mean? That That's a chest. Like, if I saw it sitting somewhere, I'd think it's a bench. It's a chest. Minor staff of turning makes undead flee. You don't say. For some reason, I have a feeling I'm not even really close to the end of this yet. Although, I would love to be proven wrong. What do we got? I hear some fluttering. Do I hear fluttering? Is that is that a Charis? That's a dead researcher. Anyway, you slice it. Now he's a naked dead researcher. That's weird. Mazulft, I didn't even get to read that. Started with an A. Started with AD, actually. It's the Mazulft of Dinner! Hold on. Hold up. A drone. I'm not sure what that means. I feel like I should know. Maybe it's just a little bit of Bethesda. Uh, prefix and suffix crunching. How you like that, farmer? Oh no, I'm stuck. Won't let me back up. And what, we got a Charis coming? Okay. Frost breath in it. And the farmer's gonna die. Can I get a killing blow? Uh, I didn't get the killing blow, but he did die either way, so I am happy. Arrows, ore, gold, don't need the lever. Weak poison, do it. Is she holding off? That's awesome. She's gonna wait until it wears out. That is really cool. Don't try this at home, kids. If you see a gigantic poison spitting bug in your house, call the exterminator. Ooh. And then heal Lydia. Okay, with as much as I'm doing this, I am... Whoa! Can't believe I dodged that. Whoa! With as much as I'm using that heal, um, that's pushing me more and more. Yeah, and my hand's gone again! Where did my hand go? Okay, there's the mace. There's the other hand. Yeah, and as I'm joking, Lydia's on her deathbed. Like, I don't care about your hand. I don't have an entire arm. The bug bit it off. Was that 30? Yeah, that was Restoration 30. For some reason, I was thinking, was that Destruction 40? Oh, my God. Must get new perk. I really do think Impact will help with combat a lot, though. Like, really, really. That stagger, once I got the stagger on my archer, the 50% stagger down the archery tree... That thing is, that's enormous for an archer. I think he already knows. Let me back up and you know what? Ooh, at least two of them, huh? Uh, do I have my ice breath? I do have my ice breath on. Oh, come on. Blick em! Oh, that hit Lydia. That's not cool. Yeah, that's what she says. One power attack took like 75% of my stamina. Ooh, Lydia got the killing blow. Did she take his sword from him? That's what it looked like. I bet I was getting arrowed in the back, too. Stop moving. You jerk. I could use my breath on him. But I don't wanna. Actually, I'm gonna go, use, use, go ahead and use the flame breath. Yeah, because it's got a short cooldown. Yay. Now let me see if there are 
arrows. I don't see any arrows in my back. I'm not real sure what uh, what did that little bit of hit point damage to me in that fight. He didn't see me yet. Always a good way to know if you're uh, being chased. Just crouch for a second. You'll see that it's uh, it's not an open eye. So you should be fine. Let's see. Can I snipe him? Sniper! Gotcha. A gloom lurker. What's a gloom lurker? I suppose I'm getting ready to find out. Take some of that gloom lurker. Oh boy, he's got magic. Since he's got magic, I'm going lightning. And because resisted... What do you mean he resisted it? I'm not used to seeing that. That's not a good sign. What are you even hitting? Okay. Lydia, go figure. Alright. Oh! Yeah, I need to watch that ice. Watch the ice. Watch the ice. Oh, and he's healing. That's not cool. There's another one coming, too. You can't heal, dude. I've been draining your mana. I don't know how you're healing. I got the lightning going on. I'm going to put that down, actually. We're going to go back to double fire. And before, oh boy, my uh, flame matronach is in the beginning throes of his death animation. So I'd better make sure Lydia stays alive. Through that explosion. And again, not much of a choice. I guess I do have this choice. Oh, 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 and I didn't get it. No, I think I gotta fight that gloom lurker again. Alrighty, I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, I've been successful in clearing out some of this room. I haven't fought the gloom lurker again yet, uh, but I figured I'd turn it on right here because uh, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get through it this time. Um, I'm kind of in this little back area where I fought him just a second ago. I've kind of pulled a couple farmers out of that area from the right side, and I believe the Gloom Lurker's over there on the left side. So I'm about to see about engaging him now. Now something else I've done to help me get to this little part is uh, if I drop a Frost Rune first, that Frost Rune, actually let me check, I was getting ready to say I don't think it has a duration, but let me look, let me see if there's a Frost Rune. I don't think, let me, let me look one more place real quick. Uh, I guess the Fire Rune would be the same. I'm pretty sure these don't have a duration whatsoever. Huh. Cost 101, 50 points of damage. Cost 80, 50 points of damage. So I've been using the Frost Rune because I'm an idiot. Okay, the Frost Rune actually sucks. The Fire Rune should be used at all times. It's 20 less mana, it does the same damage. It probably even burns them for a while. I don't know, it doesn't say that, but... Anyway, back to what I was saying. Uh, the Frost Rune lasts, uh, I think, forever, so... You can put that out, you can let your mana totally regenerate, and uh, then say put out the Flame Atronach, again, let your mana totally regenerate, and then when you engage an enemy, you have free damage right there that doesn't come immediately out of your mana pool, and then, of course, the summon that, that's not coming immediately out of your mana pool. So, uh, I'm gonna get my sniping on. Oh, just past him. He saw it, though. He's actually going that way, looking for it. Uh, I'm gonna let the Flame Atronach run out there a little bit. I'm actually kind of glad she's not being real smart about it. Because I would rather she stay here and fight here, because I would rather use that flame rune. And actually, if she'll go out there and fight and die and blow up, that would be cool with me too. Alright, look, you're coming. You're coming to get me. That was the gloom lurker. Alright, Lydia, especially Lydia. No, please. Lydia, please stay back. Please, please get back, Lydia. There was the rune. Alright. Um, do I want to use my Ice Breath on this other one so that we can focus on the one? Let me see. Yeah, I'm going to use my Ice Breath there. Alright, now I've got basically a full mana pool, and it actually looks like Lydia and the Flame Matronach are doing okay against him just by themselves. There he goes. Still took out my whole mana pool of Focusing Crystal. I have a feeling that I'm going to need that. Whoa! Wow. That's really neat looking. Their 3D modelers did an amazing job at everything in this game. 
And that's the part that's amazing. Everything. I know you want me. I know you do. You can't have me. Down. Okay, so she's not... Okay, I guess she is going to do it. Alright, well, that went way better, except for me picking up the farmer sword. Get rid... Okay, there we go. That that one went quite a bit better. That, literally my second attempt. I didn't make any attempts while the uh, camera was off. Um, went quite a bit better. Just being a bit more careful, pulling some of the guys out of this room first, fighting them in that back hallway, setting up my frost room for traps. Now, let's clear out this room, shall we? It's really nice that there were no chars here. None of those little bugs. That would have really been a pain in the butt. I would not have liked that. Just the variety in enemy. Alright, so we've got at least two different... Whoa, that's a chest. I've seen that before. 287 for 12 weight. Getting kind of close to 300, but do it. Worse come to worse, I'll have to put it down later. Or, I'll stop being stupid and I'll just give it to my companion. Don't have to put anything down ever because I have a companion. Remember, the companion. Eventually I'll remember it. Okay, so... Oh, one more little area. Hold up. Okay. Consulting the map for direction. Find shallow doors. Okay, that's some other quest. This, the oculory, is the quest I'm on now. So, the door right next to me and the door over to my left here are going to be the two doors I want to go through first to clear this area out. Master! Oh, man. Okay. Um, I don't know why, but I want to try this one. I didn't try the master earlier, but... <laughs> two taps of the key. I guess that one with three taps, that looks a little bit better. The tough thing about the really high level locks is that the space for any success is so small that sometimes it's hard to even find the general area that allows you to turn it. Oh, 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 that was lucky. It's somewhere right in here. Alright, let me set a limit. Three more picks. If I break three more picks, I'm going to give up. <sighs> One with no success. Where did it go? Ah! Okay, last pick, last pick, last pick. Mmm. You know what? I feel really close. I'm going to break my rule. Oof! Alright. Oh man. All right, I got to set a rule that I'm going to stick to. Let's let's make this the last attempt. How about that? No pressure, no pressure or anything. No pressure. Okay. Okay. Done. Finished. I can't do master yet. I am not talented enough. Imagine imagine the real life version of that same situation. A lock that is just way beyond my knowledge or capability to pick. And I'm just like, well, I've picked some other locks. Let me give it an attempt. And imagine if I would have got it. I don't know anything about that lock. But you know what? I picked it. Yeah, I'm not surprised that I couldn't pick it. I don't know that it does in this game, but in previous Elder Scrolls titles, uh, Alteration gave you spells to unlock different levels of locks, just like by casting a spell. That would be really handy, because I'm really bad at working Alteration and Illusion into my regular rotation because they kind of have weird situational combat application. It'd be really cool if they'd just give me a, a quick win for getting my alteration up. Wow. This seems like it's getting a bit deep for like an off shot. Dead bombers. Is this an area I've been through? According to the map, it's not. According to gold on dead bodies, it's not. So, where are we going? Whoa! 